I got to ask you right up front, uh, who needs therapy? Jamie Raskin <laughs> needs therapy. I mean, he, he has the worst case of Trump derangement syndrome of anyone in the history of America. I have to play a little bit of this for those who are watching and listening because this was really something today. Here we go. I, I, can, I can invite Mr. Moskowitz to come back in. Do you want to move for impeachment today? Because I thought that that was your main agenda item. You said it was the paramount priority of the committee. No, the, this is a, a hearing on China, and you all have a, an obsession with Russia and Trump. It, it's disturbing. We can talk you about China therapy. and Trump or Russia you all and Trump. Need, He's you got need a, therapy, Mr. Raskin. No, no. You, you need therapy. You're the one who's involved with Everybody needs therapy, it turns out, <laughs> Representative. Uh, it, the bottom line is this. Jamie Raskin, and I'll say this, you don't have to, but he's an election denier. In 2016, mm-hmm. he he actually um, he, he called into question the electors for Donald Trump. He wanted to overturn the election in 2016. Since then, he wants to take the moral high ground and tell you that you can't investigate what obviously the Biden family has been doing. So in that moment, what's right. going on uh, you know, in your mind right then? Well, what is he trying to do? Well, he's worked so closely with the mainstream media and the Democrat National Committee to, to try to indoctrinate the American people's mind that uh, the bank statements, the emails, the text messages and the sworn testimony that we have that proved Joe Biden was the central figure in the Biden family influence team. He's tried to indoctrinate in people's minds that that's just not true. That's Russian disinformation. When, of course, it's true. We've got bank records from six different banks, six different banks filed uh, very serious charges called suspicious activity reports with the Treasury cabinet uh, flagging the Biden family for financial crimes. We right. have sworn testimony from three Biden associates that said Joe Biden knew exactly what his family was doing. And the only business the Biden were involved in was influence peddling with our adversaries around the world. 